hey guys welcome back to my channel i am here with another bullet journal spread this time we are doing our november plan with me so go ahead and get cozy grab your supplies and let's get started so the first thing i do is check my pre-planned november spread just so that way i know exactly how i want it to be i kind of pre-planned it out then as per usual we grab our handy dandy pencil and begin to go ahead and sketch it out so that way we make sure everything lines up as it should and the first page that i do is the calendar overview so that way i can reference the days of the week um, and everything of that nature <laughs> Pigma Micron and I believe this was the 0.5 since I am doing the calendar spread so that it can be nice and bold and I just go over the lines I do not personally use a ruler I'm like to just go ahead and trust my hand uh, <laughs> so that's what I do and go in and add the numbers as well with the Stabilo point four fine liner I used one of the brown shades that came in my pack of 25 <laughs> first um, and then I go over that with the same stability fine liner that I use for the numbers <laughs> So now it's time to go ahead and move on 
to the official cover page and again you just see me flipping back and forth to verify the fonts and everything that I want to use I'm testing out a new font so it's kind of wonky um, throughout the spread so just bear with me <laughs> Spell November, so I went ahead and just ripped that page out and redid it. And this is what it looks like. From there, we move on to my next page, and that's just a quote page. And I just had to use a scripture here. Um, I only use part of the scripture where it says in everything give thanks. <laughs> list all the colors that I've used in this spread in the description box below. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 
it helps me just kind of stay on top and be more aware of my emotions especially as someone who has suffered from anxiety and depression um, it's just really important for me to just be more intentional and more mindful of how I feel so just like everything else I go in with my pencil first and then I go over it with a micron <laughs>
page simple as far as the header I didn't add any color to the header of the page because I'm going to be filling them in based upon my mood and I didn't want it to be um, too chaotic <laughs> Up next are my habit trackers. Um, they are pretty much the same as they were last month, which are my prayer, my language, my dusting, and my workout. So um, for the prayer and the language, I'll fill it in daily, and for the dust and the workout, I'll fill it in weekly because they're more weekly goals, but I wanted them to kind of all look the same. And I put a little doodle of like, a little um, tea slash coffee cup behind it that looked really cool. <laughs> pretty much follows the same uh, process as far as starting off with the pencil and then going back in with the fine liner of choice. Uh, here I use my Micron to go over the dashboard header and then I use the Stabilo fine liner to go over the separating dividing lines. I also used my washi tape and this washi tape I actually got it from a store in the area um, so I'm not sure that I'll be able to link it down below uh, but it's just a washi tape that has a bunch of different um, warm beverages that you would get in the season <laughs> and I also use my Tombow Fudinski hard tip brush to kind of try and replicate that font that I am practicing <laughs>
weekly spread now my apologies to you all but it did cut out and i did not realize it but you do see me using my grid spacing cheat sheet so if you do not have one in your journal you want to add one in or in your next journal make sure you have it it's a super helpful time saving tool go over everything in pencil um but i was able to show you all how it came out <laughs> To start off the month uh, just because you know there's so many pages in the beginning uh, so I'll do more fun spreads as the month goes on but this is the flip through I do hope that this was helpful and inspirational motivational be sure to get yourself a bullet journal or an agenda to keep yourself on track comment down below what you like to see next if this was helpful give me a thumbs up Remember, you've made it this far. Subscribe to my channel. You can follow me at Carter Me and Lisa on all social media. And y'all know how this goes. Until next time, y'all. Peace.